Yo, what is up guys? Bring you guys a video here today and man, let's get right into it. Lil Tecca, man. So this kid right here, he's been he's been balling out lately. And honestly, I'm not gonna be a bandwagon. I'm not gonna be a per I'm not gonna be like I've known about him since the day he blew up, which was probably like I would say a couple months back or probably a year ago. However, I found out about him a couple months back. However, I wasn't necessarily a fan of him because I honestly thought that he only had one song and that one song just made him popular and I felt as if that he was not necessarily gonna be a one hit wonder, but I don't think he's dropping consistently really good music or good songs in general. However, man, I heard the We Love You Tekka <coughs> uh, project, and to be quite honest, guys, it excelled so good for his age at age 17, which he just turned age 17, by the way, guys. And the fact that he's selling over 50,000 on album sales, and to be quite honest, guys, a lot of rappers, I'm not gonna point out no names because again, I don't wanna, I don't wanna point no rapper out. Each rapper deserves respect. They put a lot of work into it. However, man, this kid, Lil Tekka, one thing that I've seen right off the bat with him is he already cleared out his lyrics. And what I mean by that is that usually rappers, when they clear out their lyrics or have a confess to make saying that they don't really do this, like for example, Future said he didn't do Xanax or none of that stuff, which he obviously raps about in his music. Lil Tekka pointed that out already in the beginning of his career. And that's a good thing because number one, at least you're not leading up your fans saying that, hey, hey, I don't really do this stuff when you're already big. He pointed it out before he got big. Well, he's technically getting there, but he's already getting to the point where he is mainstream. But I like the fact that he pointed out that he's not really about that life. Now, I'm sure you guys seen the video on G uh, Genius, I think. Yeah, Genius, where he was clearing up his lyrics. And to be quite honest, guys, that's already an A plus to me for him as a rapper in general to clear up all those lyrics. Also, moving on to another thing that I know from Lil Tekka, uh, he actually had a live stream where he was talking about how fake the industry is. And guys, the fact that he's that young and already spotting fakeness from a mile away, whew, that tells you that he's gonna have a long career in general. It's gonna avoid a lot of label problems. You guys see a lot of label problems with like Uzi, for example. Even Rich the Kid, which claims he's his own boss, which makes no sense, by the way, saying that you're a boss, but then you're having label problems. That doesn't make sense to me. However, man, this kid Lil Tekka, man, if you guys heard this We Love You Tekka album, let me know in the comment section down below which one was your favorite. My favorite is Love You, but it's not necessarily new, new, new. Again, he released it a couple months back, but that was the first time I actually heard his music in general. Like, I did hear his music before his album, but again, I didn't really feel attached to it until he dropped his project, and I said, hey, this kid can actually release quality music. So I really like this kid, Lil Tekka. I'd love to hear you guys' thoughts in the comment section down below. Obviously, guys, um, Tekka, he's a very humble kid. A lot of rappers buy jewelry and all that stuff. It just doesn't make sense to me. And most argue saying that a rapper has to have an image. He has to have the dyed hair. He has to have dreadlocks or braids, whatever it is. I personally don't think it should be like that. Now, if you're an Instagram influencer or doing stuff like that, fine. But if you're actually making music or rapping in general, I think you should really focus on that instead of your image because people are not going to like you because of how you look. They're going to like you because of your actual music. That's the way I look at it. Let me know in the comment section down below your opinions on that. But yeah, guys, so this video, quick video for Lil Tech. I'd like to hear you guys' opinions on him. My bad if I'm repeating myself. But yeah, guys, so thank you guys very much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, go ahead and give this video a like, comment, and subscribe. It will mean a lot to me. Also, let me know in the comment section down below any video requests. I'll gladly... I'll gladly make sure that I'll, or I'll view that comment and see whether it's something I can do or something I can talk about. So if it's your favorite rapper on SoundCloud or a favorite rapper in general, let me know. And as always, guys, have a great day.